So we've had an incident with some of the tipper trucks already built. Somebody has stolen the windshields. What? Hey, it's Jabbo. Welcome to Brickzar, home of the world's largest tipper truck army and the world's largest, or soon to be world's largest tipper truck. So I continue to piece things together and it's, um, you know the, the, the little memes or the comics? I think Greg Hyland did the comic in Brick Journal about uh, when you're building a Lego set and you're like, just one more step. I'm, I'm sure it's the same when you build mocks, just, just one more, <laughs> just one, just one more row here. And it, so I've run into that with my mock building with this. It's like I stay up late uh, trying to figure things out like uh, the wheel. <laughs> so I don't have all the parts to finish it. I appreciate all the suggestions, but so yeah, working on the wheels. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to do the dualies. They already talk about this in a video. But last night, I stayed up doing the <laughs> the windshield piece. And this is going to be a very fragile piece. And I had to... It's not perfect the way I want it to be uh, because of the limited number of trans-clear elements uh, to build it. And I got to the top... I needed some more plates, and this is the thing. Lego does not make, like, it currently, and they have in the past, but they don't make, like, 2x4 or 2x6 or 2x8. Actually, if they just made a 2x6 trans clear plate. Now, I've got one that's trans red, and i got one that's trans blue, non-production color. So there's probably people that, in the master builders, uh, that, that in like, at uh, Discovery Center or something, they probably have a 2x6 trans clear uh, plate. If I just had some of those, it would be awesome for this. So, but I got up here and I ran out of one by, I'm using one by two plates. That's the only plates I can come up with. I had one from the old days when they made the two by four uh, trans clear plates, and those are expensive uh, to get now. But so I needed to put more, and then I realized, you know what, I should have done? I should have just made a layer of one layer around the edge and raised it by that layer, and then I went and I had to use that layer. <laughs> So I'm going to take this whole thing completely apart and rebuild it, but it actually works. Um, in, in the set, uh, this will be sitting on a 2x4 brick. So it's not going to have the same clutch power as the other pieces, but it won't matter because it'll have another plate going on the top of it once I build uh, one of the other two red plates. So I'm really pleased with that. It's going to... I don't have the studs on there. i got to order from... I can't remember which it's one, a, a European or Eastern European country. Somebody had the uh, round uh, macaroni pieces in TransClear that I need for this because those are rare. <laughs> oh, and I should mention, that's where all the windshields went. <laughs> I needed, I ended up using 24, no wait, 4 times 6, 24, 24. I, when I planned it out in my head, I thought I was going to be doing like, 30 but it actually the geometry didn't perfectly work out because you need to raise it in order for it to sit above the studs on the lower level so that kind of messed me up so it's not perfect but i think it works and so i'm going to take this thing completely apart now that i've got the initial design i know how to do that i'm going to start at the top i'm going to build the top first <laughs> and kind of build it upside down i think but uh, the, pro the problem with these uh, windshields, they don't have clutch power. In fact, mine's not going to have clutch power either. But so you have to, I had to put supports on the underside. I used one by six trans clear bricks uh, to support them. But it's coming along. I mean, I know I can do the wheels. The dualies won't be dualies. It's just there's right currently there's no way to do it. Uh, I'll probably use the thicker wheels in the back and the thinner wheels. And the, for the front two wheels. So that means the only thing left that's challenging is the tipper and finishing up the, the bricks. But I needed more bricks. And that's what we got here. DD Bricks in Thailand. One of the fastest shippers from overseas. I mean, this thing got here in day, just a few days. So it's another massive uh, package from DD. It's like the fourth or fifth time I've gotten a huge order from him and I've run out of room on the table I just there's like 
no room. And it, and it's going to be overkill. I'm going to have way more parts than I need for like some of the bricks. I think I think I in my head I thought I was going to need way more. And then as I'm building them, I, I mean I do need a lot, but not as much as I bought. So let me come over there and we'll look at this package. Oh, and one of the things we thought about doing is using uh, the, the motorcycle tires. There's another one that's more smooth. It doesn't have the knobby tires to make the dually, but it's, it just to me they're too thin. I need, I need them to be a little bit wider. And then I also thought about putting, getting a, the biggest rubber band that Lego makes, because I, I want to use all official pieces, and put it in here and see if it kind of would indent it a little bit. I don't think that would work, though. Uh, just put it around the middle to kind of simulate a dually. Uh, but, yeah, this is going to get worse. This table is just, let's just show you what it is <laughs> right now. So I don't, the, the motorcycle tire thing was just another uh, attempt to try to figure out a solution, which is, I think, I think I see why people like building mocks, because it's a lot of experimentation, especially when you're making things that other people haven't really done. And I hope this is not, I hope there's not, there's somebody's going to find a YouTube video or somebody built a giant tipper truck already. So what's going to happen? Let me get all this stuff out of here. I cannot believe how fast this guy ships. And it's very reasonable. Used to have free shipping with over $200, but now he charges shipping. Um, but it's still only like 25 bucks for shipping, which is amazing. I mean, I couldn't ship stuff to him for that amount. So, DD Bricks, uh, I've done several, like I said, several hauls from there. So, four bricks for the tipper truck. Well, uh oh, that one came open. That bag busted. So now I'm not going to know what was in there and what wasn't. All right, got. I need a lot of four by twelve. Four by twelve is like the four by twelve or six by twelve plates would be good. I think I even got some six by sixes just in case. I don't know what. Uh, yeah, it all kind of crashed open here. I think there's some four by ten plates in here too. Oh yeah, two by six bricks are also good for the one by four bricks that we're building. Well, I'm just going to have to dump it all out. The bag's already broken. All right. Yeah, and these are for the bricks. Uh, longer is better <laughs> in, uh, for having sturdiness. And 2x12s are good. Anything that's a multiple of 6 seems to be good for that. And I really should have bought more of these. Um, I may have bought all he had, though. I need a lot of these for building the actual real size tipper tracks. There's DD Bricks. Um, uh, two by four plates. I need more and more of those. Uh, these are for the the one by twos. I needed uh, one by twelves and one by tens work on the one by twos, uh, so I can start building those. The other thing I need is tiles. Uh, I this the problem I ran with the the wheels. I didn't have any. Oh, Steve, get it closer. I'm getting in front of the camera. So the one by two. Oh, whoops! That thing came off. The, I need a one by two tiles, and I can't find any <laughs> in my collection. Uh, I'm gonna, I, and I, oh, I was working on placing a bricks and pieces order to get some. They're expensive on there. So, yeah, I, I was surprised about that. Did I not order any tiles from him? I guess not. So these are for the wheels. You know, I should have enough to build all three of the wheels. And what I want to do is really have an extra uh, of all the pieces. Wait, that means I would be building two of these boogers. <laughs> uh, uh, or at least some of the parts have extras. All right, this has got some Fabuland parts in here as well. I just threw in some Fabuland vehicle bases. It's mostly just a bunch of standard bricks. Dang it, no tiles. I didn't order any tiles from you. That's what I need is tiles. Yep, that one will get me started building the uh, one by two yellow bricks. I should be able to build all my one by. I just need two more one. I got way too many bricks. <laughs> build my plate, and I don't have enough. I just realized this. I do not have nearly enough tiles, so I need to go find a set that has a lot of black tiles, one by two and two by two or two by four. Uh, Mardi Gras man did tell me there was a chess set that's got a lot of the two by four. Actually, the red is what I need. <laughs> 
the red color because I'm gonna need a ton of tiles for the four by ten plate. I mean that's a that's a lot of tiles. <laughs> and uh, yeah. And sometimes those one by two tiles that have two studs on them, I could use those where the studs are. Uh, the, 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 on here, I could use them there. So that's another alternative I can make. But yeah, I'm going to need a lot. So I'm going to be looking for these first in my collection, then sets that have them, and then bricks and pieces. Like I said, the, two, the one by two tiles were expensive on bricks and pieces. They're just like way too expensive. Oh, and I had some other things. There, there's actually, so I was looking for the curved element for the wheel. And they do make a three by three curved element in a different color that was never in a set. So I had that in my cart. I had the six by six, or the three, it's a three by six round plate with a cutout I was gonna try here. It was an, another suggestion from a, a viewer. And, uh, I had all that in my cart, and then I say I was I, w I stepped away from it and came back, and it, my cart was empty. It, the page refreshed. That's what I hate. I hate bricks and pieces. You can't like save your shopping cart. I got 71 shopping carts on BrickLink right now. They've been there. Some of them been there for months, maybe years. I don't know. And it's like they never empty unless the and even when the seller sells the stuff, it's still there. It's like hey, this is no longer available. But bricks and pieces, if you if you sneeze or something, the, your cart empties. So Lego needs to fix it. I think they make it intentionally aggravating <laughs> so people don't abuse it. Uh, but that is all I'm going to talk about today. I got more stuff coming. Uh, I just need to get more tiles. And this table is a mess now. Oh my goodness. I think I've bought way too much and not enough of the tiles. Oh well, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. I really like this. It's a classic mess in the shirt of oh, the Baby Yoda. Thank you again, BJ and Jackson, for sending that to us.